Hi, I'm Aki Salinja. I'm from the National University of Ireland in Galway and I am a mentee and Sandra is my mentor. And I'm Sandra Eldridge. I lead the scheme, to, the mentorship scheme together with Christine Bond and I'm at Queen Mary University of London and I'm a statistician there and Aka is my mentee. And Aka's going to begin um, this double act just talking a little bit about how um, she decided to find a mentor. For me, I looked at the mentor scheme for um, new, well, for a long time and numerous times I thought, oh, I'm going to do this and yes, this looks great and I would love to have a mentor. But our first step was very difficult and I really had to push myself to go for it, especially because the people that are mentors are such big names and they were, for me, the, the biggest names in this area. And to go up and ask somebody for their time to mentor me felt like a really big commitment from them. But eventually I did it and I uh, filled in the paperwork and I asked, um, I gave my preferences for a mentor and the next thing I knew I was in the mentor scheme and we met up at every SABC since. And what's interesting, and we discussed this earlier, didn't we, that, that actually when you take on a mentee as a mentor, there is also that little bit of hesitation about are you going to be able to give the mentee um, what they really need? Um, and so there was a little bit of finding our feet, hmm. I think, at the beginning for both of us. Yeah. Which, which was very, because the, the very first time you meet each other, even though you've met before and everything, but you sit down and you kind of share more personal details and everything. And once you have that first meeting, it's, it's just very easy to keep on talking. And you can talk to your mentor in a very um, safe space. You can say whatever you like, you know, it won't go any further than them. And you also, what makes it very easy to talk, you don't have to constantly explain about the academic world or how this works, which for people from outside might be, you, you constantly find yourself explaining how, um, how the academic world and how publications and how career and everything works. Whereas in this situation, you can just, about, you can just talk about everything within that uh, path. So it's been very good for me. Mm. I think there are, there are benefits also of being a mentor in, in the scheme because actually I think it's good um, at, at any point in your career just to kind of step back and, and step outside what you're doing. And for a mentor, I mean, I always, when I meet with a mentee, there's a knock-on effect for me of thinking about how am I behaving in, in, in my own work environment in relation to some of the people that I line manage, for example, or, or um, people that are in, in the, the centre where I work, you know, what, what's happening in terms of work and relationships. So, I mean, I think, it's, I think it's, there's a huge benefit for mentors as well as mentees. For me, it's been a very good experience. I can only recommend it to everyone else.